Accounting is the language of business. What does this mean exactly? This means that accounting takes information about what a company does and turns it into something a person can read, interpret, and use to make decisions. Accounting does this through two functions, measurement and communication. The first function of accounting is to measure and record the company's business activities. We need to know what business activities the company is involved in each day and keep a record of those. Did we make a sale today? We want to keep up with that and record it. The second function of accounting is to communicate all those activities to others and in a useful manner. We've been recording every sale we make throughout the year. Now, instead of handing the CEO numerous pages of individual sales figures, we can report total sales for the month, quarter, or year. We can also report on sales by product or store or region. We've taken a large amount of data and constructed it into something useful and easy to interpret. This information can be used in a variety of ways and to make decisions throughout the company. CEOs are not the only people interested in such data. There are numerous users of accounting information. Examples include investors, creditors, managers and other employees, regulators, taxing authorities, customers, suppliers, and even competitors. Each user may have different needs for accounting information and can use that information to make a variety of decisions. For example, an investor is interested in analyzing a company's accounting information to decide whether to invest in the company's stock. A creditor wants to determine the creditworthiness of a company and if they should loan the company money. A manager may be interested in the performance of a particular product or segment of the business to decide on discontinuing or expanding areas. Regulators and tax authorities are interested in information related to setting and implementing policies. Different users are interested in different types of accounting information. Overall, we can divide all accounting information into two categories, managerial accounting and financial accounting. Managerial accounting focuses on information for internal users. These would include users such as managers and employees. Managerial accounting measures and reports data such as product cost, budgets, and segment profits, to name a few. Financial accounting focuses on information for external users. These would include users such as investors, creditors, regulators, customers, and suppliers. Financial accounting measures and reports data such as profit for the company as a whole, total items owned by the company, and total items owed by the company. Created using Powtoon.